Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be a good one. We are gonna talk about all about road trips, big and small. So if you are going on a two hour road trip or a six to 10 hour road trip, I've got you covered. I'm gonna tell you all the things that we pack in our car to keep my little one occupied when you are on those spring and summer trips. Um, I can't believe that school is almost less than, it's a little bit over a month away from being done. My daughter is in kindergarten, she's six years old, so I'm gonna show you what we're gonna be packing up in the car as we're traveling around and exploring this spring and summer. So first things first, find something that is your kid's interest. My daughter could draw and color for hours and hours and hours. She just loves it. So I feed off of that and I buy different mediums for her to create art. So first things first, coloring books. I like to um, go to the Target Dollar Spot or the Dollar Tree. They're really inexpensive and I like to buy fresh, new, fun coloring books, whatever her interest is. So she loves unicorns and she loves princesses. So these coloring books from the um, Dollar Tree will be a hit and she will love them. Pick you up a pack of crayons. We have some from um, Dollar Tree, but I always put a fresh pack in there as well so she can color all her little pages. Um, I picked up this book from Amazon. Um, last year, you guys actually took three days, but we drove from California to Texas because we moved to the Dallas, Texas area. But this is such a hit. It is this little marker book. You can find them in different prints on Amazon. I will have also anything that I can linked down below. Of course, Dollar Tree, that kind of stuff, you can't link it, but any Amazon items, I will have a link. This is a really good um, book. It has tons of pages. All the pages are blacked out and I'll show you a picture that she has drawn. And then the markers are in this little pouch here. This is perfect. They have tons of pages to draw and you include a little pack of wet naps and um, some tissue and they can wipe down the pages and draw again and just draw to their little heart's content. So this is such a game changer, especially if you have a little one that enjoys drawing. Always get these little pads. We actually have two of them. We have one upstairs in the playroom, and then this one is for the car. It comes with those little pins. I always try to buy extra of the pens. That's a little tips because the little ones always wind up losing them, but I like that it has this little area for the pen, and they can draw whatever picture they like and press the button on the bottom to erase them. They have these in several different styles and um, see, I don't even know if you can. They have them in several different styles and sizes, but I like this one because it's really small and compact. I include these Water Wonder books. I get mine from Amazon. You can also find some at, in the Target dollar spot, but these are great. It's not only a story, but it's a fun little different way for your little one to create different art and kind of be a part of the story. The pins just fill up with a little bit of water and they can go to town, their heart's content. It dries on its own and it's something that you can redo over and over and over. So just a fun thing to add if your little one is obsessed with art, um, creating things like my little girl is. Okay, let's get in the category of reading. So you're gonna be driving or your husband's gonna be driving, so you can't necessarily read stories. So I like these um, little books that have the buttons on the side. This one is from Amazon and you can press them and they help you with the story. Um, they have them in several different styles. We have this, we have a Paw Patrol one. Um, I think we have a Mickey one. So these are always fun and cute um, for your little one, especially when you're driving and they're back there entertaining themselves. It may drive you a little bit crazy because you're there pressing the different buttons, but it's not bad. A little bit of sound, but they can 
kind of read to themselves with these stories and it's just fun to press the different different buttons. My next tip and trick is to buy your little one a membership to something. So we are um, have a membership to the kids National Geographics and these books as they're coming in you can save them for those big road trips in the summer and then these are always so fun for your little one to flip through. They have several different, you can do Scholastic, you can do, I'm trying to cover our address, but they have several several different kinds. But these, collect them, don't give them to your little ones yet. And then when the road trip comes, they have magazines to pan through. Older kids in these, they always have like crossword puzzles and things of that nature. So you can have that in here as well. Another good thing to throw in with the crayons is color pencils. So they have another medium to color with. So she'll have markers, color pencils, and crayons and she can just go to town and a little bit of water go to town making art to her heart's content so yes subscribe to one of those kids subscriptions save the magazines and your little one will have fun panning through these during your road trip. yes road trips are long we always take my daughter's ta tablet she has a little kindle she to be honest she's not a tablet girl she never uses it unless we are actually on a road trip um it just stays upstairs in the playroom like in a shelf but she never goes to get it out but road trips we like to load it up with movies um her holder is one that will sit up and i'll show you guys in a second um, a tray but this will sit up so she can watch all of her movies to go along with that if you don't want to hear kid movies the whole time your little one you're driving we have these bluetooth speakers that um, we picked up i will link some similar ones these were from home goods but i will link similar ones from amazon down below but these are great the little one doesn't have to mess and fuss around with the wire just make sure that you bring the charging cable but these are great you don't have to hear their movie their show that they are watching and they can be entertained. Now, um, next, we love this little magnet puzzle. It has two puzzles inside. They're magnets, which is perfect for a road trip. Each puzzle has 20 pieces. They have many different styles on Amazon. We chose this one. Um, it's like little fairies, but it just opens up. But all the pieces stick, which is great. And then they have a little template here so your little one can see what they're making and the other template is there but the pieces stick so they're not rolling around all around your car and they just fit perfectly so we have this little lap pad it just sits over her car seat she has a car seat with two cup holders so it just fits perfect this one believe it or not i picked it up from aldi and it has served us well i picked mine up last year but this year i was in aldi and they had them again maybe it's something they're going to bring back every spring and summer because they know we are heading out on road trips so i love this one it has the little area for your, your um, color pencils. You can put your crayons in one. It has this lip up here. It's all padded. Your little one can store items. And it's really small and compact. When they are done, they're ready to take a nap, which we love when we go on road trips. They take that little nap. It just folds up and you can store it away. So, is I do some Kleenex sunscreen when we're stopping along the way and checking out different sites and wipes or these are like wet wipes for my little one i always have shades i love picking up the little packs from uh, these are from home goods uh, this is a tommy bahama brand and then they always come with the shades inside she has several of these so she can change it up but these little heart ones are really cute I always throw in a little blanket in the back seat. This one came in several patterns. We chose the unicorn because like I said, my daughter is unicorn obsessed. Um, this one is really cute. It does have a little glow in the dark. It's not obnoxious, but just a little soft glow. So if you guys are driving during the night, it's a very muted soft glow in the back seat that your little one can have. But um, we love it. So if she's cold and 
because the air conditioning's on, she can throw this on and it's good. It's also good for her nap time in the car, but love this. It's big size too, so you can even fit it over two little ones or just buy them their own because you guys know how that's gonna go. I'm gonna take you in the car to show you the organizers that I have and how everything kind of fits in. Okay guys, this is everything in the car and this is how we are rolling. Everything fits in. Um, we have these organizers from Amazon. They do come in a two pack. Um, we have one over there, but yeah, everything fits perfectly. We have her little blanket and the other, um, the lap pad right there, but this is how we go and everything fits amazingly and great. I will have these organizers. They have lasted. We've had them for a couple years now and they have lasted really well. All you're missing is all the snacks that your kid's going to ask for and their water bottle, but you're good to go.